Military drones are far more than just remote-controlled planes. They represent a paradigm shift in modern warfare, a leap into a future where technology blurs the lines between human and machine. Their sophisticated robotic aircraft, marvels of engineering equipped with cutting-edge sensors and communication systems, piloted from afar, sometimes continents away, by operators who may never set foot on the battlefield. These pilots are highly trained specialists, masters of technology, and strategists in their own right. These unmanned aerial vehicles, or UAVs, range from backpack-sized, easily deployable for immediate reconnaissance, to jet-sized, capable of carrying significant payloads and engaging in long-range missions, and they have revolutionized warfare as profoundly as the tank or airplane, forever changing the landscape of conflict. Drones provide persistent surveillance, offering an unparalleled level of situational awareness, loitering over targets for hours or days, providing constant vigilance and real-time intelligence, gathering intelligence, sifting through vast amounts of data to identify patterns and anomalies, identifying threats, pinpointing enemy positions and movements with remarkable accuracy, and even striking with precision, minimizing collateral damage and maximizing effectiveness. This technology removes soldiers from immediate danger, reducing casualties and protecting valuable personnel, but introduces new political and ethical dilemmas, forcing us to confront difficult questions about the nature of warfare and the responsibility of command. Once a niche tool, relegated to the fringes of military operations, drones like the Predator, a pioneer in the field, and Reaper are now frontline weapons, essential components of modern military strategy. Rapidly spreading worldwide and reshaping global power, altering the balance of forces and creating new security challenges, the core of drone technology is the blend of robotics, remote operation, and increasing autonomy, a complex interplay of hardware and software, separating the warrior from the battlefield, creating a distance that can both protect and dehumanize. This shift changes the psychology of combat, the politics of war, demanding new strategies and approaches to conflict resolution, and raises deep questions about accountability and the value of life, forcing us to grapple with the moral implications of remote warfare. As we explore military drones, we're not just examining hardware, we're delving into the heart of a technological revolution. We're witnessing a technology that's rewiring the very nature of modern conflict, reshaping the rules of engagement and the future of warfare. The unblinking eye in the sky is now a permanent fixture of war, a silent observer, and a powerful force. For a long time, the United States stood as the undisputed leader. The U.S. once dominated military drone technology, pioneering advancements that reshaped modern warfare. This dominance was built on fleets like the MQ-9 Reaper, a versatile and powerful platform. These drones provided unparalleled surveillance and strike capabilities and the RQ-4 Global Hawk, a high-altitude, long-endurance surveillance drone. These advanced systems allowed for persistent monitoring of vast areas. These drones were instrumental in shaping conflicts in Afghanistan, Yemen and beyond, defining the landscape of modern warfare. They became a key component of U.S. foreign policy and military strategy. But the monopoly is over, the global landscape is changing rapidly. The rise of new players is challenging the established order. China's Wing Lung and CH series drones are now a major force in the global market. These drones offer a cost-effective alternative to Western systems. They now serve dozens of countries expanding access to advanced military technology. This widespread adoption is reshaping the geopolitical landscape. This proliferation is shifting the balance of power, creating a more multipolar world. The implications of this shift are far-reaching and complex. Israel, a pioneer in drone technology, continues to innovate. They have been at the forefront of drone development for decades. Israel exports advanced drones like the Heron, a versatile platform used for surveillance and reconnaissance. The Heron is known for its reliability and advanced capabilities. While Turkey's Bayraktar TB2 has emerged as a game-changer in modern warfare, this drone has proven to be highly effective in various conflicts. The Bayraktar TB2 has proven decisive in recent wars, demonstrating its effectiveness in combat. Its success has spurred further development and adoption of drone technology. Iran supplies drones to proxy forces, extending its influence in the Middle East. These drones are used for reconnaissance, attack, and other missions. And Russia has ramped up production, investing heavily in drone technology. They are developing new and advanced drone systems. This makes drones a staple in modern conflicts, transforming the way wars are fought. 
they are now an integral part of military operations. Even small nations and non-state actors are now able to wield drone power, gaining access to advanced military capabilities. This has significant implications for global security. The proliferation of drones means that more and more actors now wield drone power, changing the dynamics of conflict. This creates new challenges for defense and security. This is blurring the lines between state and insurgent capabilities, creating new forms of asymmetric warfare. It is becoming increasingly difficult to distinguish between state and non-state actors. The skies above battlefields are crowded with robotic eyes and weapons. The airspace is becoming increasingly congested. Surveillance drones and armed military drones are becoming ubiquitous, changing the nature of warfare. These drones are capable of carrying out a wide range of missions. Each nation is adapting drones to its own strategy, tailoring the technology to meet its specific needs. This is leading to a diverse range of drone capabilities. This global proliferation is transforming regional conflicts, making them more complex and unpredictable. The use of drones is changing the dynamics of these conflicts, and it's giving rise to new threats and alliances as nations seek to counter the growing drone threat. This is leading to new forms of military cooperation. Drones are no longer exclusive to major powers, they are becoming increasingly accessible to a wider range of actors. This democratization of drone technology has profound implications. They're a global phenomenon, reshaping the landscape of modern warfare and international relations. The impact of drones is being felt around the world. This is democratizing advanced warfare, giving smaller actors access to capabilities that were once the exclusive domain of major powers. This is changing the balance of power in the world. The result is a global military transformation, driven by the widespread adoption of drone technology. This transformation is reshaping the way wars are fought. We are seeing a patchwork of drone users, each with their own unique capabilities and strategies. This diversity is making the world a more complex place, each shaping the future of conflict, as drones become an increasingly important part of military arsenals. The future of warfare will be heavily influenced by drone technology. The age of the drone is truly worldwide, and its impact will only continue to grow in the years to come. We are entering a new era of warfare. The balance of power is now contested in the skies, as nations compete for dominance in the drone arena. The control of the skies is becoming increasingly important. This contest is being waged by machines, as drones become an increasingly important part of military arsenals. Drone technology is advancing at breakneck speed, with AI and autonomy leading the charge. Future drones will navigate, identify and strike with minimal human input, allowing one operator to control many machines. Advanced sensors, hyperspectral cameras, miniaturized radar, turn raw data into actionable intelligence, while stealth designs make drones harder to detect. Solar-powered and hydrogen-fueled drones promise weeks or months of flight, creating a persistent global surveillance network. The arms race now includes both smarter drones and smarter defenses. The next generation of unmanned systems will be more autonomous, invisible and ever-present. The sky is no longer the limit, it's the new front line. Drones offer clear advantages in modern warfare, presenting a paradigm shift in how conflicts are waged and strategies are formulated. First and foremost, they eliminate the risk to pilots, removing personnel from direct harm's way. This is a crucial factor in minimizing casualties and protecting valuable human resources. Furthermore, drones typically involve lower operational costs compared to traditional aircraft, making them a more economically viable option for various missions. They also boast the ability to surveil or strike targets for extended periods, offering persistent coverage and responsiveness that manned aircraft often cannot match. Their persistence allows for detailed intelligence gathering and rapid response capabilities, providing commanders with real-time information and the ability to react swiftly to evolving situations. This is fundamentally changing how wars are fought, strategies are developed, and critical decisions are made at the highest levels of command. But this physical and emotional distance can create a dangerous detachment between the operator and the consequences of their actions. War, in a sense, becomes a screen, a series of pixels and data points, potentially obscuring the human cost of conflict. This can lead to a blurring of lines, and the moral barriers to taking a life may erode, as the act of killing becomes increasingly abstract. Despite the distance, operators still face significant psychological trauma grappling with the weight of their decisions and the impact of their actions. 
They are often watching life and death unfold in high definition, witnessing the stark realities of war with unparalleled clarity. And then, they are expected to return home, to reintegrate into civilian life, as if nothing extraordinary has happened. Strategically, the precision offered by drones can narrow focus to specific targets, but this can also be a disadvantage. Over-reliance on this narrow perspective can lead to critical errors in judgment and tragic civilian casualties. Furthermore, the U.S. no longer holds a monopoly on drone technology and its deployment. Adversaries are increasingly using drones against American forces and interests, both on the battlefield and beyond. This proliferation is leveling the playing field, creating a more complex and unpredictable security landscape. The very technology that was initially intended to protect soldiers and enhance their capabilities now creates entirely new threats, demanding constant adaptation and innovation in defensive strategies. In essence, drones are a double-edged sword, a powerful tool with both immense potential and significant risks. They are fundamentally redefining risk assessment and operational planning in modern warfare, but also introducing new vulnerabilities that must be addressed through robust defense systems and proactive cyber warfare protection. The future of warfare may appear safer for some, particularly those removed from direct combat, but it is undeniably becoming more complex, more interconnected, and potentially more perilous for all involved. The drone advantage, therefore, is never absolute, and its effectiveness is constantly challenged by evolving technologies and adaptive strategies. The future battlefield will be shaped by teams of manned and unmanned systems working together. Pilots will command swarms of semi-autonomous drones, scouting, jamming, striking, multiplying their reach and power. Miniaturization is key nanodrones will slip through windows, gather intelligence or attack in swarms, overwhelming defenses. Underwater drones will transform naval warfare, mapping, hunting and striking beneath the waves. The battlefield will be saturated with drones air, land and sea, networked and coordinated by AI. Success will depend on mastering this robotic ecosystem, not just traditional combat skills. The soldier of the future will command machines as much as men. Warfare is becoming a contest of networks, data and intelligent machines. The next era of conflict will be defined by those who control the swarm. The age of the lone warrior is ending. Drone warfare raises urgent ethical questions, especially about civilian casualties and accountability. Precision doesn't guarantee perfection. Mistakes happen, and innocent lives are lost. Who is responsible? The pilot, the analyst, the commander, or the programmer? Signature strikes and targeted killings blur legal and moral lines challenging international law and due process. Operators, though safe from physical harm, face unique psychological burdens, remote trauma, and moral injury. As drones become more autonomous, the risk grows. Can machines truly follow the rules of war? The debate over human control and accountability is happening now with consequences for generations. The ethics of remote warfare are as complex as the technology itself. Drone swarms are revolutionizing strategy, hundreds of interconnected robots acting as a single adaptive force. Swarms can overwhelm defenses, jam radars and strike targets, all coordinated by AI with minimal human input. Destroying a few drones doesn't stop the swarm, it adapts and continues the mission. The US, China and others are racing to perfect swarming technology, shifting from lone hunters to robotic hordes. Defending against swarms requires new weapons, lasers, microwaves, electronic warfare. The future battlefield may see swarms battling swarms in fast, complex and destructive engagements. This marks a shift to mass, autonomy and expendability in warfare. The age of the intelligent robotic horde has arrived. Drones are now central to modern conflict, used by nations large and small, reshaping power and the nature of war. From high-altitude surveillance to tactical strikes and autonomous swarms, drones are indispensable and evolving fast. Their advantages are clear, but so are the costs, psychological strain, new vulnerabilities and unresolved ethical dilemmas. The myth of risk-free war is shattered, the danger has shifted not disappeared, Legal and moral questions, civilian harm, accountability, killer robots, remain unanswered as technology races ahead. Drones are a permanent, transformative force in global security. The challenge is to harness their benefits while managing their risks and setting ethical boundaries. The shadow of the drone will only grow longer across the battlefields of the future.